I teach a psychology of men and masculinity class every year, sometimes a couple times, and I've been doing it for almost 20 years now. And there's this moment every time I teach this class towards the end of the semester where the students sort of, without planning it, they kind of come together on a point of saying, I get it now. I get how this works, but what are we going to do about it? Like, how am I supposed to talk about all this with my family who raised me to think this way? How am I supposed to talk about homophobia? How am I supposed to talk about the importance of, of, of supporting women and, you know, and, and being pro-feminist or whatever it may be? And especially from the guys, it's, I get this, I want to change, but my friends, mm. right, they're going to ridicule me. And I always say, I don't have a really good answer to this. You know, the yeah. truth is, if you're committed to a certain way of being, you also have to think through who you're hanging around, you know? So, mm. I, I mean, I, I, my friends, my guy friends, you know, sometimes they'll give me grief about stuff. But what I've found is over time, if I hang in there, I, it is positively rewarded. And I, yeah. and I start seeing it come out in them, too. They start being more honest about what's going on. They call me up one on one and say, don't say anything to the other guys, but could you help <laughs> me talk through this issue with my wife? That always cracks me up.